my channel. If you are new, welcome to my beauty space. My name is Jenny. I really hope that my videos and reviews are helpful for you. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and um, continue to follow my journey. And for those of you that um, have been subscribed, thank you so much for the love. I really appreciate it. I love every single one of you. Thank you so much for the love on Instagram as well and the beautiful comments that you'll always leave me. I really appreciate it. So, today's video, we're going to be talking about the um, Katie and Desi collaboration with Joseph Colors. They came out with a really big collaboration. I want to say it was like eight items. I only got my hands on four. It's all good. When they always stop, I'll get the rest. Um, but I am very, very excited to show you guys what I got and my opinion on it. So the first item that I'm gonna share with you guys is this beautiful lip color that I'm wearing right now. This is like the perfect nude. Finally, somebody came out with the perfect nude for my skin tone. This one, I'm gonna show you guys. It looks like this. It's a nude, um, it's all nude with rose gold. Uh, when you open it, right here on the side, it has their names on it. And it looks like this. I'm gonna go ahead and swatch it for you guys right there. Look at that, it's so pretty. I really hope the camera is picking up that beautiful color. This little guy right here runs for $16 and it's so perfect. I'm gonna tell you guys right now, I am obsessed. I've been using this little guy since I got it in the mail. It is absolutely amazing. It's very creamy. Just perfect, perfect. My husband saw it on me and he was like, that looks really good. I was like, I know. <laughs> it's amazing. So, uh, the next item that I'm going to show you guys is going to be, of course, the highlight. Look at this packaging. This is so beautiful and so, like, glamorous and just so cute. I love it. Uh, when you open it, of course, the color is right there, and this is um, also rose gold, and it comes with a mirror. And this is what uh, this is what the color looks like. And of course, if you want to see what it looks like on the skin, I'm wearing it right now. I'm not sure if the camera's picking up the way that it looks because sometimes I think like it does and it really doesn't. This little guy runs for $28, and I'm gonna be very, very honest with you guys. I really, really do think that it is worth, look at that, the $28. I'm gonna be very, very honest with you guys. It's a very, very like, buttery smooth consistency when you dip your brush in there you just like you just need one swipe and it's just like blinding it's awesome and of course i had to get my hands on the girls <laughs> this palette is so pretty as well it has the same packaging as the other one very nice and glamorous you get the rose gold inside as well as a mirror and the colors look like that you get a total of four colors and these colors, you guys, you really have to follow the instructions on how to use them because they're not kidding when they say you need to wet it. <laughs> you need to wet the colors. There's two that you need to use wet and then the other two you can just use dry. Um, I tried using one of the ones that they said to wet it and I didn't get as much as, I mean, you do get pigmentation, but I think it comes out a little bit more chunky. So, um, right here on the little um, card that they sent you, they tell you. So let me see, it's Seuss and uh, Harpoon. I'm gonna try to make the swatching part go as good because I'm like the worst swatcher ever. I'm gonna go in with the color Turbo Sun, which is this little guy right here. I'm going to grab that color with my finger and I'm going to, oh, let me see, swatch it there for you. That color is so stunning. I'm actually wearing this color on my lid. No need to wet it, it just glides on beautifully. The next color that I'm gonna show you is this one right here. This one's called Seuss. I'm going to do the same thing, apply it to my finger just like so, and swatch it right next to it. And look at that. The most beautiful bronzy color you would ever, ever, ever see. I love it. 
For the next one, I'm gonna go ahead and spray my finger with some MAC Flex Flush. You can use water as well. Um, Katie was talking about just a little bit of water, you know, dab your finger there and then it'll, um, you'll get the, the, um, how do you say it? You get the, anyway, <laughs> you get what you want. <laughs> so I'm gonna go right up here. Look at that. So gorgeous. Love it. This is a beautiful color to put like in your inner corner of your eye. It really, really stands out. And if you wet it, girl, your eyes going to be popping. Now we're going to go in with this beautiful color right over here. It's like a weird color. It's like a mixture of a green and a gold. It's really, really awesome. That way you also want to wet your finger a little bit. Wet it and let me find space we're gonna go right here look at that color it is absolutely stunning again i am like the worst swatcher ever so here it goes my loves my opinion in this collaboration i think it's absolutely stunning they worked really hard and their hard work was shown in the products um, do I think it's worth it? I absolutely do think it's worth it. If you're able to get your hands on it when it restocks again, go ahead and do so. I can assure you that you are not going to be disappointed. Everything is popping. With all of that being said, if you want to learn how to recreate this look, then just keep on watching. Into the tutorial, I'm going to start off by priming my eyes. I am using the Milani Eyeshadow Primer Potion. You can find this um, primer at any drugstore near you. Hopefully, they have it. This one here is a clear, um, clear primer. It grabs out very well to your eyeshadow. It prevents creasing and things like that. I don't know why I'm telling you this. You probably already know, but for those of you that don't and you're just starting. Basically, this is what a primer is for. There we go. To start off, we're going to go into the Jaclyn Hill palette. I'm going to use the color Pookie, this one right here. This is going to work as our transition color. I'm going to grab a uh, Sigma Fluffy brush to apply this color um, directly into my crease and just a little bit higher. Now with an E300 uh, Mikasa Cosmetics brush, I'm going to go in with the color Roxanne from the Jaclyn Hill palette. I'm going to apply that color directly into my crease. Time to add the star of the show. I'm going to use the color Turbo Song. Am I pronouncing that correctly? I don't know if I'm pronouncing that correctly. I'm sorry. Um, but I'm going to apply this color uh, directly to my lid. You do not need to wet this one. I'm going to use my finger. Now I'm going to go in with the MAC 221 brush and go back with that color Roxanne and just like clean the, the edges.
Let's move on to our liner. I'm gonna be using the Mega Forever Aqua Black Gel Liner. I went ahead and I applied my eyelashes. I am using the Storm Lashes. These have been, obviously I showed you guys in my other video, these have been my favorite lashes at the moment. I will put their information down here for you. Let's go ahead and move on to the skin. I'm gonna prime my face using the CoverGirl True Blend Face Primer. With this primer, you wanna be careful with what foundation you use. Um, I honestly don't think that it works well with all of them. For foundation today, I'm gonna to be using this L'Oreal foundation, and to apply it, I'm gonna be using my Lemon Drug Sponge from Mikasa Cosmetics. If you want to try out their products, I'm gonna go ahead and leave a discount code right here down for you so you can go check them out. They have a lot of things. Um, they have brush sets, they have makeup, they have a bunch of different um, things on their website if you wanna go ahead and check them out and you wanna save money, discount code right here for you, okay? So let's move on to concealer. I'm going to be using my Master Conceal from Maybelline. I'm going to apply this in the areas where I need it. To blend this out, I'm gonna be using my sponge. And then I'm gonna jump in with my Morphe M173 brush to get the areas where the, I don't want the sponge to go. Like I don't want the sponge to mess up my liner. So I use this brush right here. It's a really good one. Now we're gonna set our under eye area. I'm using my Laura Mercier translucent powder and I'm gonna use a sponge, my Real Technique sponge. It has like a flat bottom and I'm just going to set that powder. For bronzer today, I'm going to be using this MAC bronzer. This one is Cheeky Bronze. It's this really pretty, pretty bronzer. I haven't used this one in a while. So I'm going to use it today. For blush, I'm going to be using the color um, Blush Baby. This one's also from MAC. Let's go ahead and highlight this guy right here. Ever since this one came to my life, I have not been using any other highlight. This one is Mirame. Oh my gosh, you guys. It's so pretty. I'm going to apply that. Look at that. Oh. I see you. For lips, I'm going to be using this little guy right here. This one is the More Creamer Please, also from the collection. I've been obsessed. So this is it, my loves. This is the final look. I really hope that you enjoy this uh, review slash tutorial. And I will see you guys next time. Don't forget to give me a thumbs up. Leave me a beautiful comment. Like and subscribe. And most important, don't forget to be your own kind of beautiful. Love you guys. Bye.